Hey, 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 guys, it's Old Man G here, back again with another video for Red Devil Studio. Um, if, you're new to, if you're new to this channel, please like, share, and subscribe to Red Devil Studio. Smash that notification button to get the latest Manchester United content. So, today we're going to talk about Douglas Costa. Douglas Costa. Um, so, basically, this is coming from his agent. This is coming from his agent's mouth. Um, and essentially, um, United had a strong link towards getting Douglas Costa in a summer transfer window. Frankly, I'm not sure why. But apparently, according to Douglas Costa's agent, United showed a strong interest, a very strong interest in signing the player. Um, but Juventus manager Sari blocked any potential exit from the club. His agent basically goes on to say, I sincerely say that Allegri and Sari have never thought of letting him go. Branchy, who's the name of the agent, told the mail. Um, the interest in Manchester United was strong, a club that has always been interested in the Brazilian. Okay, It was not the only club, but in England it was certainly the most active team on the trail of, the, of Douglas Costa, which is fair enough. Douglas has had countless health problems. I've seen him very often injured. He's wanting to recover great professionalism. He's still standing still. Juventus never intended to sell him, despite the big pressure from United. So this is what this agent is basically saying. Now, as we've, t as we've discussed with Bruno Fernandes agent, you know, this could just be typical agent talk, trying to pick up the player, trying to get the player a meal, a move, sorry, blah, 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 blah. And there could just be nothing in this at all. Um, but I do think it's interesting that, um, that again, we would mention United. Um, again, United linked with another player. Um, this time, obviously, Douglas Costa. It's coming from the agent's mouth. Um, Frankly, to be honest, this whole summer, I don't think Douglas Costa was really maybe mentioned once or twice when they were talking about Dybala and Mandzukic, but I don't think Douglas Costa was really a serious um, rumour. But it's interesting that United were, in quote, strongly linked um, with Douglas Costa. Um, personally, I don't really see what Douglas Costa would have brought to Manchester United, especially in the fact that he has been injury prone. I just think that he's not um, he's not the right fit for Manchester United at this moment in time. And you can clearly see Oli wants to go with youth, energy, pace, etc., which I don't think Douglas Cost at this moment in time has. He's been struggling to get into the Juventus team regularly, partly because of his injuries. So, most likely or not, to be honest, this, um, this information, which while I was reported in the mail and all these different you know, pseudo-UK newspapers, this obviously is coming from the agent's mouth. But to be honest, I think a lot of these agents are spewing nonsense. Um, listen to this bit. They're spewing a lot of nonsense. Um, and um, I generally think that if Manchester United were serious about getting Douglas Costa, they probably would have bought him um, outright. Um, but okay, Juventus didn't want to go. Fair enough. But again, it just kind of shows. That I don't think it's true. But to end, it shows that if United were interested in him, it just shows just a complete and total um, joke, I guess, of our transfer policy. Um, it's, it's just an absolute joke. It really, really is um, that we that when we don't seem to be linked with players that we that we need um, or th that we need to fix in a particular area, but that we're more concerned sometimes about names. Um, thankfully, Solskjaer's transfer policy would bring in like um, Maguire. Um, James and obviously Wan Bissaka, you can see they both slot in. Well, or they've all slotted in and all played well. So you give him, you give him credit there. But I just think that you know it just goes to show that we really need to push on and get that director of football because I just think that our transfer business, where we do transfers, is just still so so poor. Thanks again for listening, guys. Again, this is just a brief video. There's not really much else to go on on the fact that United could have signed Douglas Costa, they didn't because. Um, uh, Sari and Allegri didn't want him to go, despite the fact that United have been apparently heavily linked with getting Douglas Costa for years now, and this one wasn't any, any different. Um, tell me what you think in the comments. Do you think we should have gotten Douglas Costa? Do you think it would have been a good addition to Manchester United Football Club? If you haven't already, please like, share, and subscribe to Red Devil Studio. Follow us on Twitter at WeUnitedX. Smash that notification button for the latest videos. And don't forget to join our Fantasy Premier League um, winner winning a official Manchester United top. Have a nice evening, guys, and cheers.